What's up, Target fans? And what toy mom? It's your girl, some toy twins. I'm Maya. And I'm Micah. And today we are super excited to be doing the Target Challenge live. Yay. We are so excited to be here, y'all. In the last episode, the audience guessed this week's theme. We gave three clues lavender, pillow, and snacks. And here were your guesses at home glamping, nap time girls night in and a few of you got it right and guessed sleepover <laughs> we have our cozy pillows and our blankets and some snacks you guys know it wouldn't be a montoya twin stream if we didn't have some food next to us so i got some popcorn and chips what are you munching on my own? i got some chips as well and some chocolate covered almonds because they're my personal favorite let us know what you guys are eating at home because i know y'all are snacking right now especially if you're from our streams i know you're snacking <laughs> Elijah says, Montoya Twins, let's go. It's going to be lit. Yeah. It's going to be so much fun. I'm so excited for you guys to be here right now. It's Chamoy. It's Chamoy said, so let's get it. Oh my gosh, that just reminded me of something. <laughs> Haley Barber said, yay, yes. Now, before we go any further, we have to shout out all of you out there for creating this amazing challenge, which we've actually done before on our YouTube channel. If you guys don't know who we are, we do have a YouTube channel and we did this with our family a while back and it was really fun. It was so much fun. Uh, Tara Torres said, hey, from San Fran Jose. What is up? What is How good? are you? Now, we obviously love the Target Challenge, so we're super excited to do it again, but live. The difference? All the surprise gift swaps are shoppable on the stream. That's right, you guys. Y'all can shop as we're showing what we got each other. You guys can get what we got. And um, all you have to do is click the icons when the when they pop up in the comments, and you'll be taken to a shoppable link. Yes, and by the way, guys, our comfy fits are also from Target. So if you want to shop those, there are click clickable links as well in the comments. Everything you see here is from Target. Oh, yes. Besides Mike and I. So <laughs> and might as well have been born there, though, because everything we own is from Target. So make sure you subscribe to Target's YouTube and Facebook because every episode is a new theme. So you don't want to miss out. Facts. Um, but yeah, we're so excited to be here, you guys. And um, doing this live is going to be so interesting because with well, the first time we did this with mom and dad, it was obviously edited. Yes. So we could edit out some reactions. Y'all know I'm a better gift giver than Maya. So she says. So I'm not going to be able to hide it on my face if I don't like the gift she got me. But no, she's going to like everything. I guarantee I will like it. So in case you guys haven't heard of the Target Challenge, here's what it's all about. Let's roll it. so excited after that just played because i already know what this is all about but you guys don't know what it's about and i just already know that my gifts are so much better than micah's i can't wait for her to see them anyone from our normal streams know that i'm the best gift giver it's my biggest love language Not today. so we'll see about that but we want to hear from all of you go to the comments and drop a heart if you've seen a target challenge live before um live episode before sorry and if you have it and this is your first time then drop a star Today, we'll be putting how well we know each other to the test. We were given three categories all around the theme of sleepover and challenged with buying a gift for the other based on each category. Yes, I think we know each other pretty well. So I think we got this down to T. I'm scared that we got each other the same stuff because we do have the same taste and stuff. And if you guys seen our previous videos, our birthday gifts, we tend to get each other the same thing without knowing. So I can't wait. We had so much fun the first time. So I'm excited to do it again and take it live. Um, the first time that we did this, though, I didn't get to shop for Maya, so this is going to be new for me. I had yes. to shop for, I believe it was um, my, no, I shopped for you. You didn't get to shop for me. I shopped for my mom. Yes, and she loved the gifts I got her. Yes, And I, mom loved the gifts I got her. She mm -hmm. still has the mini clock that I got her. So. Oh, yes. Austin <laughs> Torres says, favorite twins. I love these girls so much. Mike and Maya, oh, much Austin. love. Thank you so much. Um, okay, so... What's y'all's favorite parts of sleepovers? Let us know. I know mine is binge watching movies and TV series, starting new shows and all of that jazz. I could stay up watching movies all the time. I am known to start and finish series in the same day. Yeah, when oh. she's supposed to be like editing or something. Oh, yeah. She'll finish a whole series. Mine is personally when 
all of our friends get together for a sleepover, we go to the grocery store and then we come home and we make dinner together. Instead of like ordering in, we all like to do quality time and uh, make food together. Right. What about all of you and our lovely co-hosts? Take the poll and let us, t- I'm sorry, and tell us your favorite thing at a sleepover. Is it binging movies, the snacks, or napping when nobody's looking? I am definitely one to be the first to fall asleep. I'm a party pooper and Jeez. I can't keep up with everyone's energy. <laughs> I like to be the one that keeps everyone awake because I don't want the sleepover to end. So I'll be up till the next morning. It's bad. Jill says, okay. Oh, Kayla Van Devin, you ready to shop? Uh-oh. Is that your friend? You're calling out her best. You're calling out your friend right now? This is so fun to do. I always told Micah once we like get boyfriends, which if that will ever happen, I want to do this with them. So we no, that would be a fun date. Figure each other out and it's like a little date night. Well, Thank I you. think we have each other pretty figured out, but I guess we'll see how we did with this gift swap. Um Daisy McCauley says making bracelets. That's cute. Oh, making bracelets at sleepovers. That's cute. Tara Cash says, I love shopping at Target. I'm right there with you. Mike and I always go. We're like, okay, we're just here to get some groceries. That's all we're getting. And then we'll leave with clothes and stuff. It's really bad because yeah, we have our own Target cards. Yes. <laughs> That's bad. how addicted we are. And we, we're actually going today. Yes. Later. <laughs> um, Corinne Cal- Calzada, I'm sorry, said movies. What type of genre movies do you guys prefer, though? I like thrillers for sleepovers. I like thrillers, but not like horror movies. Um, and also romantic movies. Crystal asks, how are you guys different? We are different by, well, first of all, our hair colors are completely different. Mine's so much darker than Micah's. Um, our makeup is, we do our makeup differently. She has a birthmark and a baby face. I have no birthmark, and she says my face is more like defined. Chiseled. People actually ask if we're sisters before they ask if we're twins because they don't. People don't believe we're twins. Yeah, I think people actually think we're lying about that. Yeah. <laughs> um, but personality-wise, we're very different. But it's weird because we also complement each other. Yeah, we balance each other out, but we like the same things as far as like music, food, hobbies, interests, all that jazz. But yeah, our personalities are completely different. I'm more reserved and shy, and she's the outgoing, so she adventurous says. one. She's the social butterfly out of us two. <laughs> Um, Daisy McCauley says, napping when no one is looking. I'm definitely guilty of that. Maya caught me napping yesterday when Mm -hmm. I was supposed to be editing. Um, Pit Dog says, I'll always be the one to stay in and eat all the snacks. Oh, yes. Having a sleepover is definitely an excuse to eat all of your friends' food. (laughs) I'm the type that makes all the finger foods. Like, I'll make mini sandwiches and, like, chocolate-covered strawberries. Like, that's, I like doing that. Okay, I think it's time that we get into our first category. So for the first category, we were challenged to buy something cozy in our favorite color. Now, Micah's favorite color is black. I think everyone knows that. It's a it's shade. shade, but but you guys get what I'm saying. If you can't tell, literally everything is, yes. has an accent color of black. But am I going, you're going first for me? I'll give you your gift first. I'm nervous. Don't be nervous. But okay, so Maya doesn't necessarily have a favorite color, and I guess I don't either since black isn't a color. Um, but I feel like she's pretty much the same because, I, like I said, we're the same as far as what we like. So that's what I went based on for a gift. I'm scared. Wait, oh my gosh. Do we get each other the same? We're both thing? very simple gals, so I went the simple route. She got me a black tank top. This is cute. It's like nice and ribbed and thin. I like tank tops to um, work out in and stuff, but even to lounge around the house. This yes. would be perfect. There's I could a- put this with everything. I could throw a hoodie over this. Oh, yes. I like this because you can dress it up or down, and it's about to get hotter here in Texas. It is. So <gasps> she can wear it just like that, or when it gets cold, she can throw like a cute flannel over Are it. Are these fuzzy socks? I got Maya some fuzzy socks. This chick, I never catch her without fuzzy socks. I on. don't have any ankle fuzzy socks. Yes. I have long fuzzy socks. So this is perfect. And they're black. So they'll go with everything. I don't know about y'all, but I'm kind of OCD about matching my PJs. You guys. So if I wear socks, they gotta match too. Some people don't know what fuzzy socks are, but basically they're like they're so a sweater soft. on your foot. Like, <laughs> they're, they're so, so cozy. I can wear these, yeah, in bed while I'm editing because I do have shuffles, but they're ginormous. They're huge. So this will be perfect for in my bed. I love these. Thank you. And now, are these joggers? Yes. Okay. So <laughs> we have a lot of black joggers, but these ones are cute because these are stretchy. The ones that we have are, I feel like you wouldn't just wear them every day. Like these ones you could pair like with the tank top and make an outfit out of it. Like the other ones I feel like are 
meant to cover up like your shorts or something when you go right. to the gym. No, these ones are stylish. Cute. They're like legging material almost, like yes. yoga pants. And a lot of our joggers are baggy, and these are like legging joggers, so they'll fit you nice and tight. I'm gonna, I don't have to wear these at sleepovers for all the food I eat, so I have room to breathe. I also like them though because they're stretchy, and yeah, they do feel like yeah. leggings, and they're like a off. Black, I guess you'd say. They're more like a charcoal kind of thing. Yeah. If I'm ever in this whole fit, do not mess with me. Like, I'm in all black. It's like being <laughs> She's going to look like a ninja. Yeah, don't mess with me. Oh, my gosh. Good job, Micah. Thank you. I love that you all keep that. Do you see how many things I got you? Yes. Do you want to see how many things I got you? What? Yes. Okay. You ain't the only one that's thoughtful. Okay. <laughs> I can already tell there's a lot of stuff in here. Yeah. I hope you like it. Micah! No, ma'am. I'm excited. There's okay. so, many, so much tissue paper. Oh my gosh, surprise, surprise. It's black. Wait. <laughs> we got the same. Got, okay, no, they're not the same. same. They're not the same. Okay, they're no, different. the pockets are different. The pockets are different. But we have the same taste, see? Black joggers. You can never go wrong with a pair of black joggers. Okay, I like these pockets. They're very, I like Yeah, the ones she got me have the pockets, like, they go square. straight in the front. They're more for square. style than convenience. Yeah. Well, these are convenient. You could throw some, like, cash in there, some snacks in there. And these are a lot um, thicker mm -hmm. than the ones I got you. These are really nice. Thanks, Maya. Daniel said Ma Micah definitely winning this challenge. I don't oh, know. Okay. So. You already know. No. Are we going to act surprised or what? Ruby says, on my way to Target for short fuzzy socks. I am <gasps> redeeming myself. <laughs> today i'm redeeming myself oh my gosh no <laughs> no we did not i already saw what else is in the bag we got each other the same tank top okay y'all it's this ribbed cute tank top though so no wonder i both picked it out this is gonna be nice to work out in because i'm self-conscious about the crops that i have because they're super cropped <laughs> so this is nice but also i don't know if you took this into consideration but i prefer square cut tops like this just because they're more flattering on my body type, I feel like. So I don't know if you put that into mind. We can be matching. got that for me. But thank you. Mike and I haven't twinned since, like, high school. Well, we're kind of twinning right now with the tie-dye. Tie-dye. But we haven't, like, worn the same outfits in forever. So now we can match. Remember, y'all, if y'all want to match with us and be our little triplet, or if you guys want any of the cute stuff that we got each other, make sure you shop along with us and put the links in the comment section. Okay, and then I got one more gift. <laughs> they're not fuzzy socks, but they're really fuzzy. They're and so thick. cute. Why do these look like little like bunny, bunny ears? ears? Yeah. <laughs> so you they're thin and slim, so you can wear them on your bed too. And y'all, I'm super um clumsy, and these have the little grippies at the bottom. She does trip a lot. I I trip a lot, metaphorically and, and literally. literally. Yeah. <laughs> do you like them? Yes, these are cute. And I like how these aren't black too. Yes. So like, there's a little it difference. Will change. Yeah. For once. I might take those from you because I like those. I'll share those little slippers. Okay. Let's get into the second category. We started off with a bang. Okay. So for the second category, we had to buy something to keep you up late. Me and Maya are night owls. This is not a surprise to anyone that knows us. We, we upload late. We stream late. Like, it's bad habit. Yeah. It's probably our, our, it's our only flaw. Not our only flaw. <laughs> We have a lot One of, of our flaws, flaws, but that's our top flaw. It's our, um, nighttime is our prime time, basically. How late do you sleep? We don't. We don't sleep. We don't sleep. <laughs> <laughs> it's bad. Okay. Ready? Can I have it, please? Wait, what are you doing? Just making sure. Okay. Wait! That's literally the gift you just gave me. Yes. <laughs> Why did you take it from me? That's why I was like making sure. I was like, that don't look right. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, this is heavy. I knew, I knew she was gonna say that. Wait, why don't you like? I know what this is. <laughs> Wait, can you tell what it is? Just looking at it though. Yes, it's the one. It's the paint when you dump it on the canvas. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna take this from you. Ow, Look at how in my hair. So being a twin and having like a freaking Jack and Jill bathroom, it's pretty. Can I open it? <laughs> it's my gift. I'm choking. Let I'm so excited. I'm going to explore. What well, are, are I was these? trying to show them. What are these? Oh, okay. it's to cover under your canvas because you have to pour all the paint. So it's going to, you don't want it to go everywhere. Wait, oh sorry. my gosh. This came with a lot of canvases. So as I was saying, 
me and Maya being twins and like having conjoined rooms, it's pretty much like having a sleepover every night, especially since we're like the same age and stuff. But usually it doesn't feel like a sleepover unless we actually have a friend with us or like our older sister. Since she lives across the country, it's rare that we get to have sleepovers. So there's a third canvas. So nice. it's perfect for a sleepover activity. Wait, how did they fit all this in the box? There's so much stuff in here. It came with everything that you need. There's so Look. many different paints. There's sparkly paints, uh, glitter. glitter, I call the, the stir paint. sticks. There's, all this uh, fit in there. These are metallic too. Look, you have your gloves. You have um, cups so you can mix colors. I called black. I know what we're doing tonight. <laughs> well, I can use it too. This I is suppose. perfect. Aw. I like love it? it. Yes. I feel like this will be so much fun. I was always intrigued watching these videos online when this was like a super popular thing. It still is. I've always been curious on like how long it takes to dry. Because it's a lot of Because it's a lot of paint. So we're about to find out. I'm excited. Thank you. Uh, Kristen Cav says, how cool is the painting kit? It's very cool. I'm, I'm really excited. I'm excited. And canvases are pretty, like, pricey. So the fact that that kit came with three came with three in the paint and everything that you need is awesome. Okay. I hope you like it. Because I like you. it. I just paper cut myself. Oh, wait. Yeah, there's, a, there's one in there to show you what it looks oh. like done. Okay. Why so, do I feel like you're okay? I was debating giving you this too because I was debating giving you that. I had that in my in my cart first before this one. So if y'all don't know what this is, this is a resin. Um, oh, sorry. Create your own resin tray kit. I used to be obsessed with resin. It's just the technique of how to make it and stuff, and the different things that well, you can make with it. Look what you can make. This is. I have an example to show y'all what you make out of this. But oh, go ahead and open this. It's like but a look, ring tray. Look how big it is. It's huge, but basically it's customizable. And I was like, Mike and I always wear our big hoops and our rings every day. And so we need like a little jewelry dish and this will be perfect. It's the size of my hands. Huge. It's and look, ombre. That's so pretty. Yeah. You can customize it to your liking. Like you could do glitter, no glitter. So color. this is the mold that you pour the resin in. Resin is like pretty much it dries like an acrylic, I guess you could say, but it's super like technical how it's done. And I've had a, um, resin sitting in our in our cabinets for a while but i've been so intimidated to try it because i don't know what i'm doing but this comes with instructions and stuff i did so. not expect the molds to be this big they're huge you could you know what you could put all in this moon this little crescent moon you could put your car keys your id your jewelry your lip gloss what the heck daniel says sheesh michael thought of something they could do together what a thoughtful gift absolutely oh, i'm always me thoughtful. too Always Me taking too. into consideration what Mike wants Me to do. Me too. No, this is. Get a uh, vote. What we should uh, do first tonight? The painting or the resin? <laughs> yeah, let us know. See, oh, I so I nice. know Micah's always been into resin. And she I owns, have a huge bottle of it. She owns resin. She's never done anything with it. So I was like, I'll get her more molds so she can get more. Yes, I only have one mold. And I've been super intimidated about trying it because I don't, like I said, don't know what I'm doing. But now I do. Look at all this glitter and stuff. I can't believe how well made this is like yeah this, this is from thick. target that you make you guys you can make it yourself it's thick all right y'all there's a poll so tell us how crafty y'all are is your artwork more like mom approved or practically picasso oh mine's definitely mom approved because mom keeps anything we make mom keeps anything we make even i was literally just looking at some paintings that we did a few years ago and she has them hung up in her bathroom there was posters there that horrible yeah there was posters that we made like back in second grade for an art competition and um we kept them for so long turns out dad threw them away because he's like what are we gonna do with these whereas mom would want to keep them forever and ever <laughs> but we do have a lot of artists in our family our dad including is one of them and yeah. then our sister as well our grandma is super artsy i think she'll have fun doing that too our family cannot sing or dance we're, we're they're all decent at sports but they're all artistic so <laughs> pretty crafty yes. and mom is definitely a do-it-yourself type of gal yeah so we get that from her but for our last category we are challenged to add this to your nighttime beauty routine so maya this is your last one right here you notice how she's opening my gifts last because we save the best for last mm. our mom is in here joanne montoya she said yes yes i do the poll one for mom approved wins oh yeah mom 
are our mom of our Bruce. biggest fans. Okay. So I'm adding this to my night routine? Yes. It's huge. What the heck? <gasps> Wait, I actually need this. <laughs> okay, I know you're probably thrown off, right? It's so big. So it's big. humongous. Okay, so this is a little turntable. It's um acrylic, so I like it because it can match anything, like any decor. It doesn't matter if you change your room or not. But our rooms, our bathrooms, the shelves were not built. Our cabinets weren't built with, with shelves. shelves. I yeah, so they're just these long cabinets with all this empty space that we can't put anything so in. So much empty space, and I was like, it's not organized at all. So I figured Maya could use this. And organize it look you can use this for multiple things though like I have the my... paints that we just got in our little kits i have my brushes right here so i can show you but you can just put like your, all your makeup brushes in one or like hair Perfect. stuff and then all your skincare since our cabinets are so long when you spin this you won't have to like reach over things yeah. and mess up anything that you have organized it'll just spin around that is so funny because when we did our target challenge last time you got me that outlet that plugs into the wall that has the shelf and stuff in it like she's always getting me organized all right you know she I knew won you were gonna bring this up. she won most organized in our class one year <laughs> yeah maya got future athlete or most athletic i got most organized so jam fam i already know who that is that is our sister and her family so wow i need that marissa now. could definitely use this because she has so much makeup. i already know she's gonna ask for this but it's mine I'm keeping it. Okay, you're gonna be so thrown off when you hold mine. I am, mine was so heavy. IMG Crazy said, "Is the popcorn real?" It is. It yeah. is real, y'all. We got drinks and we got chips. Okay, let me move this out the way. Make sure. Last gift. Last gift. Make sure it doesn't fall. Okay. The best for last. <laughs> it's so light. Yeah, it feels like it's empty. Okay. So Micah <laughs> does a lot in her in her nighttime routine like she's in the bathroom for hours and one thing i noticed that she doesn't do is like have a lip scrubber <gasps> like you always just put on bomb and call it at night this is a lip we were scrubber. really talking about lip scrubbers earlier yeah so it Wait, i've gonna... never seen this before yeah it's like a little spoon and it has two different sides one side exfoliates and the other side um gets the blood flow going so that we like it massages get your lip? so they get pumped oh wow because blood flow can stimulates. you see the little bristles it's like um, lips. silicone and it is soft because it goes on your lips obviously but you put what you do is like put lip balm on and then you just scrub wait that's so cool i know i want, I want all the kisses like i've that. never seen this before because you can use that you're not sharing this no we cannot share that <laughs> but i can go to target and get my own yes as maya had mentioned i do take a long time in the bathroom it's not necessarily that i have a lot going on in my nighttime routine i just happen to be slow at everything i do but let us know how much time y'all spend on y'all's nighttime routine is it like 10 minutes half an hour let us know uh i honestly it ranges i can do 10 minutes if i want to be in bed immediately no, or I, don't. I can drag it on for an hour or just not do it at all i don't do anything special if at most you're lucky if i take off my makeup at night like maya doesn't take her makeup off half i the time. do i do take it off i just don't like to it's so time consuming well but that, i love everything i got no that will be so come in handy because i like to take care of my lips i like to do like lip masks and lip scrubs and stuff like that so that would be perfect i need to go get me that i so, definitely like that my gifts kind of coordinate with each other they're like gray on gray they i do. definitely like it more because i already have a lot of black and you already got me some black stuff i think my favorite gift was the first one that we got each other because we were matching we literally got the same That's exact true. thing for each other if you guys didn't know obviously this was all surprise we don't know what we picked for each other so I think that was my favorite out of all of them. Because that's just like our twin instincts. I think this was my favorite. Because I've never seen this before and it's so handy. Yes. But Mikey James said, I think Micah won. You guys, what? I think I redeemed myself. So this, let's review really quick. So Maya got me. Let's review so you can understand how I won. No. They're all I, great gifts. Yeah, let's but... review so that way they can understand how I won. So I got the little lip scrubber. I in the shoppos. I can't reach all my gifts. Blaze says, my nighttime routine is just brushing my teeth, so about three minutes, oh well. So I got the paint pouring canvases, and then we got our matching jogger and tank top set with the fuzzy socks. Yes, our matching sets. That's so cute. Shopos, um, and then I got the paint pour. 
kit as well. And then I got the organizer. I'm so excited to try the paint pouring kit. I think it's gonna be so fun. You, over the resin? No, they're both gonna be I fun. I think the but resin's the, gonna be so but fun. But the paint pour one is like more. You get to be crafty with I it. Don't where think the resin, you have to be like super. You guys, I don't technical. think I get enough credit for any of my gifts <laughs> ever. My gift does not give me I credit love for my gifts. Oh, this is this is gonna come in here. I'm gonna use this every day. Oh, I'm gonna use this every day. Okay, see, I already don't care about my skincare routine. So the fact that you still do it and have a baby, like. Yes, props, props to you. Props to Ruby. Ruby. That's awesome that you still have a skincare routine. Yes, we know how that is having kids and not having enough self care time. Yes. Because our sister, when we watch her kids, there's like no us time at all. But if we're being real, y'all, all of our gifts were great. I think everyone deserves the great gifts that we have. So make sure you shop the links um, in the chat and you guys can have everything that we got and we can share. Yes, Besides the lip share. scrubber. <laughs> but we want everything. to thank you guys all for hanging out with us and for stopping by. This was so much fun. It really means a lot to us that you guys came. Um, we, excuse me, I'm sorry. Here are three sleepover challenges we did this week. So you can do your own with your bestie. There's something to make you cozy in your favorite color. Something to keep you up late at night. And, and add this to your nighttime beauty routine. Yes. Don't forget to hashtag Target Challenge Live and tag us and Target and Stage10.tv so we can all be watching y'all's challenges and your gift swaps. Yes. And don't forget, every episode is a new themed challenge. So tune in to shop and hang out with other amazing creators on our upcoming episodes. The next challenge will be on April 28th, same time and same place. Can you guys guess what next week's theme is going to be? I'll give you three hints. Dice, strategize, and family fun. It sounds like a game, like a family like game, game night, night, which is up our alley. Yes. We're super competitive with our family, and we're always looking for new games to play. So we'll definitely tune into that episode, and we hope you guys will be there, too. Yeah, let us know if you guys are going to tune in, because we will. Um, I honestly think that this this brought us together. I think they always <laughs> do. Yeah, but I like that we got similar things. Like, I, literally almost the same yes the crafty thing we both got same DIY outfits. stuff same outfits and then the beauty I think the beauty thing was the only thing we got different I can store my new lip scrubber in her acrylic turntable <laughs> oh wow oh wow Tara says sounds like game night it definitely it does sound that's like what game I'm night. thinking it is as well but thank you guys so much for stopping by this is so much fun again I definitely enjoyed this compared to the last time we did it because we got to shop for each other. I definitely think I deserve... No, I was trying to hold your hand. Oh, what? I thought you were knocking it off. I definitely deserve more credit. You did. I'm honestly surprised because we got the same thing. So if my gifts were good, your gifts were good. You know what I mean? So I think it was a win all around. Yes. Tune in to find out the next episode. Um, We got closer doing this, like I said. I appreciate all my gifts, Micah. There's no winner. I love the gifts I gave you, and I love the gifts that you got me. We can agree to disagree and say no. That there's we both no winner. Did really, They're really all good. great gifts. Okay, we both did really good. Let <laughs> us know, y'all. Let us know. Decide who won. Yeah, I already saw no a comment decision. that Micah won. So there's no decision. They were all great gifts. But make sure you guys, if you do this with your bestie, use hashtag. Target Challenge Live, tag Target, us, and Stage10.tv so that we can look out for the things you guys get your besties. Yes. All right, y'all. Go ahead to Target right now so y'all can go get everything or shop the links. (laughs) Adios, you guys. Talk to y'all later. Have a good day.